Hey guys, your boy Tig back with another video. I just got my Ultimate Chucky doll today and uh, I'm going to show you guys right now. It's very, very light. It's, it seems different from the Cedar Chucky doll that I purchased a couple of weeks ago. But let me go ahead and show you guys what I'm working with right now. Alright, so here it is and it's all glory. You guys see number of cartons, 3,668 out of 4,000 that's been made of Ultimate Chucky dolls. I actually thought they only made 400. They made 4,000. So I guess the next batch, if they do make another batch, probably be like sometime next year, um, it will probably be 400. Uh, mostly, they always like come out like 400 batches for some reason. But I guess since they just released this, they're going to come out 4,000. But as you guys see, 3,668, that's the number I got already. And it just came out a month ago or a month and a half. This hasn't been out that long and it's already that high of a number that I got. So I'm glad that I got one anyway. I uh, even say Trick or Treat Studios, Description Doll, Child's Play 2, Ultimate Chucky Doll. This box is very, very, very light compared to the other Seed of Chucky Doll that I bought a couple of weeks ago. This Ultimate Chucky Doll is very, very light. So uh, this does come with, a, well it doesn't come with a voodoo knife, it's sold separately, making this even more money. Um, the voodoo knife I did get four days ago. I uh, made sure I bought this a while ago so I can get it fast and first. So when I do the open boxing, I'll have the whole complete set. I also do as well have uh, the batteries as well, the good guy batteries. So that's pretty funny. And I do have a stand and another stand's coming in like less than an hour from Amazon. So I'm going to have both stands as well. I got the voice box for it. And yeah, guys, I'm very excited to see how this looks. And uh, I cannot wait any longer. So let's just jump right on to this unboxing and uh, I cannot wait. I'm so excited. Even though I don't sound like that, I'm that, I'm that excited. I really am just really tired. Uh, let's just open this this way. Let me be careful not to puncture the, the actual box that's inside. So I got to be extremely careful. let y'all see this part all right again remove the black things again for the corner so you can keep the inside of the box nice and in good condition so it stops it from rumbling around the box this is when you know you got it from trick or treat studios because they're the only ones that really do that so the same type of boxing style as see the trophy doll and this should reveal, oh my god, <laughs> this should reveal the box. Okay, let me get it on out and uh, let's see how this looks. I'm dying to see how it looks. Let's get this out. Let y'all see it before I do. Okay, oh. Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. That looks extremely good. Oh my god, that looks really good. Here, let me take it out. Let me take it out of the little plastic here. Okay. And for the ones that don't know, that this is Trick or Treat Studios' latest, newest doll that they have came out with. And I uh, just want y'all to know that because some people, you know, probably don't keep up with this type of stuff. And don't understand why this stuff is so expensive. But as you guys see, the quality of this box is insane. And so much detail in this box that I'm going to definitely show you guys everything that it saves on the box and everything. This is, this is really cool. This is the actual, it's not the actual box from the movies. It has the yellow and everything like that, but you can tell Trick or Treat Studios definitely put their type of stuff, their type of graffiti and everything, and their mix on top of the, on, on the box as well. And uh, it looks great. So let me go ahead and show you guys. Man, he looks scary. Let me go ahead and show you guys everything on the box. All right, so the bottom of the box. 
I like that little detail there. <laughs> we got Partners Toys. Let's try to say that, but they got it like smudged out like it's cardboard out it <laughs> like the cardboard's off of it it's pretty cool i like that we got collect all the good guys accessories we got in blood ages 14 and up and moving up box some more detail here a little more detail there some more detail there cardboard and then we got some blood we got a chucky's hand of blood on the box oh my god little sprinkles of blood there <laughs> man this freaking box is super detailed super detailed good guys he wants you for a best friend right here we have playland toys i can't see what that is was that 99.99 crossed out i'm going to and stand them up I think I already showed you guys this already. That's the side of the box. I'm going to turn it to this side. Yep, he wants you for a best friend, good guys. Yep. Oh, actually, I think I showed you this side. What about the back? Good guys, he wants you for a best friend. Let him share your secrets. Hi, I'm a good guy. Let's play. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. And that's the side of the box. I Man, I'm just ready to take them out. I really am. Let's see what it says on the top of the box here. He wants you for a best friend. Okay, we get it. <laughs> we get it. And that detail again with the cardboard. I like it. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and take them out. I might be able to do it with one hand. I know I probably have to do it. It's probably going to be in that contraption like it was before with my Cedar Chucky doll. So. I'm just gonna get some scissors and cut that out. And yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this out. So out of the box, I don't know if I saw that or if I got that in the video, but it has some blood there as well. And then now he's out of the box, you see he has some more blood there, his little hand. More blood at the top of the box there. And then we got a big splatter of blood down here by the feet super detailed box and yeah let's get them out now all right guys so i wanted to say this too for the people that do uh get this doll or already bought it and haven't got it to their door yet when you see something like this what you just want to do is get some scissors and just literally cut through all of this it will save you so much time because before on my see of chucky doll i i ripped up the uh tape and then I just had to undo this and like get it untangled and uh, make a loop, get the loop out and all this bullshit. Just cut the shit off and cut all that. It will just save you so much time. So that's what I'm going to do. Just a heads up for the people that, you know, haven't done this or always do it or do what I did by just literally undoing and unraveling everything. Just cut it all off. So, yeah, just wanted to put that out there. All right, guys. So now I have him outside of the box and here he is in all his freaking glory. He looks amazing. His hair is really long. I do have him on a stand. My Cedar Chucky doll stand. Uh, his stand gets here in like less than the hour. Um, but here he is from the back. His hair is super long. Way longer than the other Cedar Chucky doll that I bought two weeks ago. Um, he does have that same type of skin complexion as the Cedar Chucky doll. That's what I know is right off the bat. He's also way more squishier, I feel like, than a Cedar Chucky doll. And on top of that, um, what else was there different? He's actually kind of shorter than the Cedar Chucky doll. He's only an inch shorter. Um, I looked it up. He's only 29 inches tall. But the Cedar Chucky is only uh, 30 inches tall. So it's only an inch difference. Not that much of a difference, but he is shorter. Um, he is lighter as well, like I said. He's squishier. Um, but other than that, he's made out of the same material as the Cedar Chucky doll. So his hairnet's still on, so I'm going to go ahead and take his hairnet off. And I actually kind of forgot how his hair looked on Child's Play 2. I, I honestly forgot how it looked on Child's Play 2. I really did. Um, let's see if, it's, if he's all in the frame here. I don't know how I should do his hair because I honestly forgot how it looked on Child's Play 2. I really did. Um, I guess it looked crazy. Let me see. 
Um, shit. I have no idea. Man, this hair is fucking long as fuck. I think it was like some crazy shit like that, wouldn't it? I don't know. I might have to play around with it. I, I forgot how it looked. Oh, I think it was something like that. Yeah, I think it was like... Yeah, so I forgot how his hair was. Um, so I'm just going to leave it like that for now because I literally forgot how his hair was. But here he is in all his glory. The overalls are still the same. I don't see any differences from the Cedar Chucky doll when it comes to his clothing. His clothing, even the details on his shoes. Of course, Cedar Chucky had the scars on his face and everything. Obviously, he doesn't have scars on his face. Uh, his teeth looks pretty freaking good. His eyes look insanely, insanely good. Um, it looks like he's looking right dead at you. It's freaking insane. Shoes. But, um, so what this doll does, this is why this is the ultimate Chucky doll right here. Because I'm going to show you guys why he's the ultimate Chucky doll. <clears throat> so, he can, you can take his hands off. On the other dolls, you cannot do that. This is the only doll you can take his hands off. And on top of that, you can even take his head off. So, you can just remove it. Like, completely remove it. It's crazy. I like that. Look at, look at that. So now, this is how he looks. So you can, you can completely remove the hands. You can move the arms and everything. Obviously, you can move the arms and all that. Um, but it's freaking cool. I, I like that little feature. Let me move it back some more. I like that little feature. And then um, I can put it back on. The magnets on this, I do feel that they're very, very weak. I do suggest you guys buy magnets for this. I do have magnets already that I'm going to put inside him. Um, they're very, very strong, so I'm definitely going to use that with him because I already have some magnets already. And then his hair goes on. It's all magnets. Um, you guys want to see. I'm going to take his head back off. As you guys see the magnet right there all right and another cool feature about him as well um if you turn him around you can also take the back of his head out <laughs> so you can literally just i don't know where it's at somewhere in here you could just grab his hair and take it off like that and look you can do that and inside I'm bringing a camera. Inside, you have this like contraption to where you can move his eyeballs and everything. It's really freaking cool. You can move his eyeballs. And um, I'm not going to do it in this video. Maybe in my review or something like that, I'll do it. But I don't want this video taking too long like it already is. But you can move his eyeballs. It uh, has magnets inside. Again, all the magnets in, on this Chucky is very, very weak. I think the amount of money you're paying for this doll... Yeah, the magnets they should have got that they should have got that better definitely should have got that better and it just pops on just like that again you can't even tell like that his head comes out <laughs> you can't even tell the back of his head comes off but you guys see look at the length of his hair his, his hair is really freaking long but i think on the sea of chucky his, his hair was this long so they got it wrong on the sea of chucky doll his hair was short on the doll but in the movie on Sea of Chucky, his hair was long. So they did that opposite. Now, the child, the child play 2 doll, his hair was sh short, like the Sea of Chucky doll. But in the movie, long. They got it opposite. They got it opposite on both of them. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Oh, yeah. How can I forget? And also, this doll, the ultimate Chucky doll, he actually can hold a knife in his hands. So let me step him back some more. And I'm not sure how this is supposed to go in its hand. So I'm going to take it. I'm just going to take his hand off. Because I'm not sure how it goes. This is my first time doing it. So let me just take his hand completely off. I'm guessing. I'll even do it in the camera. I'm guessing it probably goes like. Like that. Oh, yeah, his thumb goes right there in the middle of it, looks like. Awesome. 
and it looks freaking cool. Like this looks extremely, extremely good. This is why he's the ultimate Chucky. Um, it looks like he's coming at you. Like he looks extremely intimidating. This I definitely don't suggest to kids. Even the seed of Chucky, I don't know what I'm talking about. Even the seed of Chucky, I don't suggest to kids. But uh, this is very, very, very cool looking. And this is a must get. It retails for the same amount of price as the Sea of Chucky uh, doll does. This retails for about uh, $599.99. But uh, out of the gate, you'll be spending $700 with tax and shipping combined. Let's skip that. And on uh, if you also want the accessories, uh, the knife was about $32, $33. Uh, the batteries was about $20. Uh, I suggest you guys get magnets for it too. The magnets, you can get like 15. Like just some, I don't know. You can do your research on the magnets. Uh, but I do suggest magnets too. So all this is, I suggest you get this with the doll as well. Uh, the audio box or a Bluetooth, something like that. A small Bluetooth that can go in him. I suggest that as well. But again, that's optional. The Bluetooth is optional. The knife, I do say that's a must have. So you definitely got to spend money on that. The batteries, again, that's optional. You don't really have to get it, but it was in Child's Play 1, and it's pretty, it's freaking pretty cool, so that's optional to me. Uh, the stand, I do suggest you guys get a stand. He can stand on his own, but, again, a stand looks way better. You know what I mean? Like, I think the stand makes it look way cooler. And, uh, yeah, you don't have to ever worry about it falling. And since I have carpet, I really don't have to worry about that anyways. But this guy looks extremely good. So I do suggest the stand. I suggest the voodoo knife. Um, if you want him to talk, like a little Bluetooth speaker, I suggest that as well. So you'll be spending a little bit more extra money on him. So you'll probably be spending like 800 some dollars now because you want to buy all these accessories with it. Again, you don't have to, but I do suggest you do it. So again, the batteries, the voodoo knife, the stand, uh, magnets, uh, and a Bluetooth speaker. So a small Bluetooth speaker, so like five things. And yeah, other than that, it's this is pretty much an amazing, amazing, amazing doll. Definitely gonna look good next to my Sea of Chucky. Um, this is really gonna scare a lot, a lot of people. Uh, he looks really, really menacing. He looks really evil. Uh, this is just, I'm just in shock right now. Like, this looks fucking amazing. Really fucking amazing. And, uh, yeah, guys, so I, I don't know how I'm going to close out this video. Oh, should I close out this video of him talking? I can put the little blue speak, Bluetooth speaker in the back of his head. I'll have to put it in his overalls like I do with the Cedar Chucky doll. I can put it in the back of his head, and uh, we can get him talking that way. So I'll do that one sec. All right, so I got the Cedar Chucky doll out and Child's Play 2 doll. Um, Hi, I'm Chucky. Want to play? Uh, but I didn't even put your, your batteries in, Chucky. I didn't even... I, I didn't put your batteries in, buddy. How am I going to play with you? I didn't even put your batteries in. Just playing. Anyways, uh, they look amazing. Uh, they look ph phenomenal. And I'm so happy I got them. Hi, I'm Tommy. And I'm your friend to the end. Heidi Ho. <laughs> Man, that's creepy. <laughs> that is fucking creepy, bro. Freaking creepy. But they look amazing side by side. And I, again, I'm so happy with this purchase. This is probably going to be the last doll. You know. I like to be hugged. What? Life is short. <laughs> what? Life is short? That's supposed to be funny? That's not funny. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'm, I'm so happy I bought these. This is probably gonna be my last doll I'm ever gonna buy. Uh, they are gonna come out with different faces. Life is short. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chucky, and I wouldn't talk if I were you. Hi, Dio. Okay, I'm done.